Ladies and gents, this improv is based on the idea. Women can't find plug socket like the story commence. Mary was looking everywhere for a plug socket in her house. Yesterday, like every house, most houses plug sockets. The day, there was none of them. A lot of the times you can't find your cable, you can't find your charger, a problem the day, but she couldn't find a plug socket. They'd all vanished. She didn't know what was going on. So she went to the police and said, I'll tell you what it is. All the sockets are gone in my house. They said, how is this a police matter? Well, somebody's obviously broken in and taken the plug sockets out. Plaster there there was. Um, I don't know. Because they said, I know you I know you are catching real criminals as they say, murderers and all that, but sort of criminal offence has happened to you. The police said, Is this a joke? And uh, Mary said, No, use tell you the joke is you are a joke. This whole fucking thing's a joke. Bye. She walked out and she went back to the house and she went like, right, what's going on here now? She's looking about. Maybe I can turn this to my advantage. So she put an advert on the internet to say, come to my retreat. Great for writers and people just wanting to get away from the rat race. There's no sockets here. There's electricity for the lights. But there's no sockets. Come and get away from it all. She started getting all these hippies coming. Hippies sort of long hair. You know, with flowers and things like that. Like right out of the 60s. Hey man. Like that. Right out of the 60s. 60s and 70s. And she said, so that will be £80 per night. And they started hitting out with other part about, oh, who cares about money? Well, my bank, who I fucking have to pay my mortgage to, they sort of care about it. So until they change their mind, I'm not changing my mind. Now, where's my fucking money? Hey, man. She went like, oh. Place, they, they left. They'd only been in for two minutes, but already the place was humming a hash. The Polish chapped on the door and went, I'm very, very sorry, ma'am. Uh, can we come in? Very, very sorry about, we heard about that. We're trying to change the way we work here. Very sorry about how, how things went there at the station. Can we come in? They came in, they smelt the hash and they went like, right, you. Cuffed her. As she was getting taken to the station, somebody from the UN said, stop right there. Officer, have you not heard that cannabis has been downgraded in terms of its dangerous level? It's not like next, no there with like heroin and all that anymore. And the police officer said, yes, but it's up to individual countries to, to, to decide what the law is going to be. And the person for the UN said, what country is this? And he said, what is this? Is this like something for Back to the Future? Where somebody goes, hey, what, what day is it? It's Tuesday. Yes, but what year? What year? Where am I? This is, this is Partick. Yes, but what country? Yes, but what planet? Like that. You kid, where am I? This is Partick, sir. Yes, but what planet? Nobody, the, the policeman and the UN person and Mary were all like that. What? What? What's going on here? So the policeman like that, listen, see what all that fucking hash, that smell of hash, I've forgotten. What about you? Mary said, I haven't got a clue what's going on. And the UN person had been puffing all day because it was that person that decided to downgrade hash because they were stoned. Nobody knew what was going on. So they all decided to part. Mary went back to the house. Still 
and, and, and soon as she went back, all the sockets were back. All the sockets were back. She got a chap in the door. The hippies turned up and they went, we're very, very sorry. We realise that we're in a capitalist system as much as we don't like it. You need to pay them, so we need to pay you. So we've put some money in your bank account um, and we're ready to move in. And she went, well, the sockets are actually back now. And the hippies were like that. Um, right, you know what? Just leave it. Just leave it. And she said, what about your money? She said, who cares about the money? Who cares? And she said, well, listen, why don't you come in? But don't use the sockets. They came in. They planned on no, they planned on no using them. But you know what it's like, you say to yourself, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna use my phone, that's it. See this weekend, I'm not gonna look at Twitter, you end up doing it. They sat down there like that. Smoked a bit. But eventually they were like that. I'm gonna charge up the phones and just to see what the news is with hash. With the UN we'll see how things are going with hash and all that. Or the hash news. Started with a next thing they were on fucking um, Foxy Bingo. They were a mess, stressed out their box. That is Foxy Bingo, isn't it? After a wee while, they ran out of hash, and Mary said. Then you just want a cup of tea. What? Do you want a cup of tea? No, 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 no. You know what these fucking hash, you know what these hash heads are like? When they run out of hash. What, what, you can't, they can't even look you in the eye. When they do look you in the eye, that's when things have got really bad. So this is what they're like normally, like you're you're the person. You've you've not you've really got it to me. Do you want a cup of tea? No. You know I don't drink tea. Kind of look you in the eye like that. No, you know I don't don't drink tea. I drink coffee. And they'll only look you in the eye when it's got really bad. Look, will you just fuck off, okay? Will you just fuck off, man? Because you know people smoke hash, that's what, that's what they're like. This is what they're like on hash. That's what they're like after. The end. This whole thing's been an exploitation film simply to talk about hash. That's what they're like on it. That's what they're like after. Four out of twenty, thank you very much. See these hash heads? That's what I like on it. That's what I like off it. That's a good one, that. By I was getting fucking messages. See when I open my DMs. I was getting messages for people going like, oh listen, come on. Lay off the hash heads. We're no all bad. It's a fucking joke. Say it again, says Thin Lemmy. Hash heads. Oh, that's what I like on it. Hey, hey. that's what I fucking like off it. Morning. <laughs> Fuck off. Moody Bins and Stevie, Greylag, Nartho, Shrines, Scuba Steve the First, thanks for the subs and tenor. I'm going to be honest, I'm an American. So thank you very much for coming. Oh, there's mail. And I can't understand half of what's said. That's alright, that's fine. You're talking about me? 
or just in general. But what I can put together is great. Love what you do and will always watch. Thank you very much. I can un understand that it is a bit difficult for you Americans to understand half of what has been said in general. Video game fellow, Revolutionary TV, we Gaz Galloway, thanks for the subs. Watching in the office, jealous of all the work. All right, thank you very much. Yeah, check this out. 